I wanted to create a piece that kind of spoke to the, the complexity around uh, urban development and harken back to the history of, of, of redlining and, and just, a, just creating a piece that people can actually think about those issues. Wards were designed in a way that separated people and that this ward that we're in, the third ward, actually Scott Street was a place, a demarcation line where the people of the third ward, which are largely African-American community, were not supposed to go past that or they'd be on the University of Houston campus. U of H is part of the third ward. We're not separate from it. So I think it's important that people understand that we're, we are part of the community and they are part of the community. Looking at the piece and trying to understand it, there are some hints of things that they could actually uh, dig into and do a little research and find out about the Shape Community Center, Project Row Houses that's in the area. He literally maps out where we all are and wants to sort of show the distinction, but also bring up the idea of breaking down that border, blurring that line and engaging all of us together in a dialogue and a conversation about working together, building the community. And our art should be reflective of that and tell a story of law and justice, law and society. And so almost many of the pieces have that frame so that it reinforces what the students are learning in class, that you may see a beautiful collage like the line, you see this beautiful piece of art, it catches your eye, it's so big, it's so magnificent, but then there's a story behind it, like there's a story behind every case the students read, every statue they read. There's a story hidden in the art, there's a story hidden in the piece of work, there's a story hidden in the case. And that often is story is a story of who is excluded and who's included. That's the story of the American experience. The painting is not specific and direct, but there are all these little references of things that hopefully people will be able to pick up on, explore, and have some conversation about it.